Man, talk about great timing. We just started serving grilled steak today. We're doing our part to spread this town's specialty dish. Plus, we've already got an excellent grill. Great. That's just a yakisoba griddle. Oh, well, steak is steak. Yep. It's far from a filet steak, though. Like you said, steak is steak, so just dig in. Yukiko, are you okay with this? It's not too heavy for you? I'll eat it. I'm still mad. <laughs> Aww. So, back on topic. I wonder what kind of person the culprit is. If you focus just on the announcer's case, it seems like a revenge thing. Maybe it was her lover's wife. But Miss Suzu Hiragi had a solid alibi, didn't she? And it, it seemed like she was already separated from her husband. Really? You know an awful lot about this. Okay, what about the second case? Saki Senpai. She found the announcer's body. Oh yeah, she did. Assuming the same person killed them both, then why target Senpai? Hmm. Coincidence to shadow up, they knew each other? Maybe they knew each other? Wait, you're saying Senpai and that Yamano lady knew each other? Senpai never told me anything like that. Maybe it was to keep her quiet? She could have noticed something that the culprit left at the scene. I probably should have went with that instead. But the killer just threw the announcer into a TV, right? I don't think he would have left evidence the police, much less a high school student, would catch. That's true. Yeah, exactly. Man, I thought the countryside would be a snooze. But it's proving to be a lot more exciting than I thought. Oh, that guy. Oh, they updated the menu. Huh, isn't he that detective? He is. Hey, you were at Dojima-san's. <laughs> I'm not. Oh, wait. Hey, this is great timing after all. It is? Dojima-san said that he'll be leaving work on schedule tonight. Could you pass that on to Nanako-chan? Sure. Yo, I'm Adachi, Dojima-san's gopher. Uh, I mean, his partner. He means gopher. Are you this busy every day? <laughs> Huh? Oh, well, the public seems to be getting a charge out of these cases, but we can't leave it at that. Sorry to butt in, but could it be that the killer targeted Saki Senpai in order to silence her? Maybe. <clears throat> um, sure get to the heart of the matter. Yikes. Of course, we're also thinking along those lines. She was killed right after the announcer's body was found. Mm -hmm. If the killer was trying to silence her, there might have been something at the scene only she would have understood. Which would mean that the culprit may be someone close to Miss Konishi. Mm -hmm. Nothing like that points to Misuzu Hiragi, so... Oh, I might have stumbled across something here. Wait, are you listening to all that? Crap, me and my big mouth. Uh, don't tell anyone I said any of that, or Dojima-san will flay me alive. <clears throat> Relax, kids. The police are on the job. <laughs> okay. See ya. Bye. Oh, you were right, Yosuke. The police are totally useless. Yeah, yep. <gasps> oh, my steak's getting cold. Could you shut up about the steak for five seconds? <laughs> Damn. They waited for the two to finish eating, they decide to go to the TV world. Again? Oh, I don't want to do that. I guess we're gonna look for clues or something. Wow, this really is inside the TV. It's Teddy, and it wasn't a dream. Are you feeling better, Yuki-chan? I did what you said. I've been a good bear. <laughs> oh, I see. 
Good boy. <laughs> well, this bears part of the reason we want to find the culprit. I'm one of the group now, too. Let's work together, okay? Yep. I was thinking the same thing. That's why I got these ready for you, Yuki-chan. Yeah, the glasses. And she, I think she got the red ones. Oh, oh, so these are what everyone's wearing. Thank you, Teddy. She was good in that. You're right. It's just as if the fog doesn't exist. Mm-hmm. Hey, tell me something. How come you have so many pairs of glasses? That's a really good point. Excellent question. Guess what? I'm the one who makes them. Yeah, but why do you make them? I've lived here for a long time, so I came up with some ways to be comfortable here. I see. But don't you need a pair? Ooh, good point. Another great question. Listen to this. My eyes themselves are lenses. Hey, he's not a real bear. You didn't know? Nope. Of course not. Why are you being so mean? You act like you're not interested. I'm a really dexterous bear. See how smoothly my fingers move? Teddy is delicately moving his fingertips. Oh god! <laughs> is he trying to fondle a Yosuke? What am I even looking at? <laughs> Ow! Damn. Hmm? You dropped something. Oh yeah, what is that? <laughs> That's a pair I kind of screwed up on. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> um, um, Yukiko? <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> How do I look? <laughs> Very ridiculous. <laughs> looks great. Does the picture look snatch? Uh, looks great. <laughs> looks awesome. <laughs> <laughs> Do you like that one, Yuki-chan? I want to wear this one. It's even got a nose guard. <laughs> oh, oh, no, you don't. Might be a bad idea. How very unfortunate. That pair doesn't have the right lenses in. <laughs> Teddy, shut up, please. Guess I should have made an actual pair. Yeah, we'll show it got one anyway. Aw, too bad. Looks great though. Here, Chie, your turn. Ah, oh, man. All right, fine. All right, let's see this. It's gonna be great. Come to this. Wow, this looks great in her. Oh my god. Yukiko san? Hello? No, oh, she's laughing her ass off. She's having a great there time. There goes one of Yukiko's laughing fits. I never thought she'd do it when someone besides me was around. These stupid glasses are useless for investigating. I mean, what the hell's this nose for anyway? For comedy, obviously. Nice work, huh? That's what happens when you guys leave me here alone and I get bored. Well, I'm glad that she's in high spirits again, I guess. Yeah. Chie, <laughs> oh, look on your face. <laughs> it was so funny. Oh, glad that she is having a good time. I can't stop. <laughs> oh, oh, my stomach. <laughs> <laughs> wow. <laughs> well, as long as she's happy. We decided to go back for the day. Good. Let's not go. Let's not go to the TV world for a while. Ooh. The fourth and the fifth. Hmm. I think I might be able to get the fourth and the fifth off. Oh. Really? Really? What? You don't believe me? Always cancelled. Oh, not every year. I know you wanted to go to Jeunesse, but I wouldn't mind going a little further out of the neighborhood. Yeah, sounds great. Let's go like 
out somewhere. Really? <laughs> Can we go on a trip? Yeah, let's do it. Uh, well, it might be okay to go on a trip once in a while. I'm sure it'll be crowded everywhere, though. Yay! <laughs> We're going on a trip! I'm down for that. Sure. Hmm. All right. All right. Then we need to think of some place to go. Hmm. How about you? You want to come along with us? Um, sure, yeah. Yeah, well, let's all go together. <laughs> Looks like Nanako wants us all to go. You'll be going out, uh, you'll be going on an outing with the Doshimas during the long holiday. I'm fine with that. Let's bring boxed lunches. Hmm? Yeah, good idea. We're always eating side dishes for dinner. But uh, I can't cook, and Nanako's not good enough yet to make them by herself. Hmm. Well, it'll work out. That's what we get this guy for, huh, Nanako? Am I gonna cook? Yay! Box lunches! I'm not a good cook. It's a bad idea. Nanako's pleased, though. You've been selected to pack- You've been selected to pack the family's box lunches. Uh, gonna have to figure out how to do that. Well then, this is actually really cool. Let's talk to Nanako and see how she is doing. <laughs> vacation, vacation, I can't wait. I can't wait either. Let's see, yes, Nanako for mission. Let's see. Okay, fifth, or fourth and fifth is gonna be Wednesday and Thursday. Tomorrow's gonna be Sunday. Alright, I can do that. No problem. Let's talk to you here. No vacation, huh? Should make reservations now. Might be a good idea. Something over there. No, it's Dojima. Can do anything in the kitchen? Kitchen. There are some ingredients you can make lunches for tomorrow. Nothing in the fridge. Huh. How do I? How the hell am I gonna make lunches now? Hmm. Eh. Let's figure it out. Let's go upstairs real quick. We need to be settled for the time. The incident has been settled for the time being. We should rest now. Yep. Let's go sleep. You have the day off from a school today. I wonder if someone will show up in the Midnight Channel tonight. You can only wait and see. What should you do today? Hmm. We should probably go around shopping. Figure out how the hell to uh, make box launches. Hello, this is Chia. Do you have any time to go inside the TV today? Now that Yukio is with us, I think it might be good for her to get some experience being in that place. Just give us a call if you want to go. See ya. Chia hangs up. We just thought about exploring the TV world. I feel like that's just a way to tell us, hey, you should really go to explore the TV world now. Hmm. Yeah, let's go do that. Why not? We left it, but now we gotta go back back in there. Kinda kinda suck. Give me a little make no lunches from this. Hmm. I should probably go to town before going to Juness. Spend it outside until evening? Yeah, let's go do that. Let's do Central Shopping District. Oh, while I'm at it, let me go ahead and put on the numbing medicine. My mouth still hurts, so uh, please do excuse me real quick. There we go. I should be able to function for a bit. Hmm. What have we got here? Ah, <sighs> spent so much on those infomercials. I heard talking about some amazing commodities, gotta remember. I just can't see from us. Uh, I just can't see myself spending so much money once it show starts. So much money. So let's go here. Have you heard? It starts on 22nd of this month. Get out. What does? Kakam's amazing commodities is what TV shows with handsome with a handsome answer and what bargains. Oh, you just start watching. Oh wait, oh you saw that before. There's nothing in the bookstore. Let's save here again just in case. Oh, you missed like 10 hours into this game. Wow. Alright, let's go through and see if we can go by the store. It might be a tough shop, no woman standing to the store. Nothing there. Can we go in there for food ingredients? Because we gotta make lunches. So I don't know if this is a place for us to be at. Hmm. Maybe this will allow us to make food. Welcome. Uh, medicine, buy medicine, raw bead, roll of jelly. We have enough medicine currently. Yeah, we have plenty of everything. Mouthwash, cure silence, broken by tea, sedative stimulant. Cruise isn't down, manage ball. Hmm. Nothing that I need here. 
Maybe if I walk around for a bit, I'll find a store that actually has, you know, proper groceries, so I can actually buy things from there. Let's go to the next district over, the northern district. Hmm. There's a Chinese diner. Hey, there is Chia. Hello. Come on. Hey, want to go inside the TV now? There's no harm in getting some real combat experience. Since Chia wants to get inside the TV, will you call your friends to go with them? Um, I'll go later. Yeah. Okay then. Yeah, we'll go later. Don't worry about it. So the Dagaku, so the Dagaku. What can my food is person made? What would you want to buy? I don't want to buy anything. But I would like to see if maybe there's a grocery store around here, so I can actually get some food. Hobby store that's closed currently. Shop is closed. Okay, the shop is closed here. The shrine, we can't go in there. There's gotta be a grocery store around here somewhere. Textiles. Barber. There's a barber. Can we go in there? Shop is closed. God, every shop is closed out here, isn't it? Um, Connection Liquors. That's closed, I think. Clo another closed store. Vending machine. The amp 120 amp drink? No. Hmm. I don't know where we get lunch ingredients from, but whatever. Let's go back to Chia. And go back again to the world where a lot of bad things happen. We all don't want to go back in there, but she really wants to, so. Come on! Okay, let's go back inside TV then. Let's go. Okay, let's give it our best. Yeah, let's go! She is fiercely determined. Cool. Alright then. What's the plan today, Sam Kuhn? Ah, uh, I can find a situation. What have you got? After all the trouble you went through, I'm sorry I don't remember anything. Oh, she looks nice. I like her. I like that dress on her. Like we said, it's totally okay. You're safe, and that's all that matters. Yeah, thanks. But I wonder what the killer is going to do next. For now, all we can do is keep an eye out in the minute channel, wait for his next move. <sighs> Guess let's go inside the TV. All right, let's. Let's see what Yuko is like in battle. That'd be pretty cool. Damn. We got all four people with us. Hey, there you go, Sensei. I'm so bored. Can we just have all four people to go in, or? I forgot to tell you. For some reason, I feel powerful shadow in this castle. Maybe this world is getting unstable for people going in and out. I don't think the shadow is related to a culprit, but I don't like it being there. You'd be happy if you could defeat it for me. I think I know what the shadow is. Because apparently if we play with certain people out there, then what's gonna end up happening is that... Hmm, I should probably check on her persona there, see what it's like. You can kill with your persona. It's a priestess, huh? Slightly restores HP, deals like fire damage, like fire damage, and media, and slightly restores party HP. I wonder if I can fuse some things together today. Hmm, let's see what we got here. Here's personas. Forecast first. Today's forecast. Create a persona Jack Frost. Risk fire at a bonus stat. And then none for tomorrow. So today we have to see if we can make a Jack Frost persona. If we could make a princess persona, that'd be a lot better. Doesn't seem like it's gonna give us that ability. Unless we try to combine things together. To make a priestess, this could be a priestess. Sakimitama. Another priestess. We don't have any attunement with Yukiko though. Fortune Empress Fortuna. We don't have any fortune, so we're not gonna summon that. Can't do any summons today. Alright. Well, let's see what we got here. Going to into the TV world and see what's what's up. Going to get rid of the Shadow Castle. To be honest, sort of forgot what the castle is, but I'm sure Chia and Yuka sound don't forget. You ask one of them to show you the where it is. Oh, yeah, that'd be great. Uh, Tasuka, Yuko. It's all thanks to you that I'm here, isn't it? Damn, I really want to thank you. Go to the castle. Yeah, let's go to the castle. Don't want to go there, but if you say so. I don't want to go there either, Yuko. I really don't. Let's talk to you, get in the way about a girl. What have we got here? I remember, even if I'd rather not, move from party, never mind. Okay, this is where we can move people from party. We don't want to go in there. You just said you want to go in there. So, where are we training? 
Nobody wants to train! You said you wanted to go there and have you go, go in there and try out the battles. Didn't you? <sighs> Whatever, let's go ahead and at least run around for a bit. We should be geared out enough to just kind of explore some of the upper areas. But oh, we gotta go all the way from the start, huh? Hell yeah! Nice! You know what? That was actually pretty damn cool. Not bad. Got him to level 16, good. Magic, agility, everything is up. Awesome. That's actually really good. <laughs> We're doing good here so far. Just get to the final level and then see if we can get out of the dungeon for a bit. And that's... we're gonna leave it at that afterwards. I think everybody had enough time in here. I'm pretty sure I don't want to make everybody suffer throughout this dungeon. Let's just get out of the zone as soon as possible. There we go. What we do? We turn to the entrance. There we go. I'm pretty sure it will allow us to come back anytime soon, so... Ah, <sighs> Welcome back! Hey! Don't return there. Oh, hell no. Let's go and get out of here. I'm getting hit on by a girl. What a shocking encounter that was. <laughs> okay. Thanks, bud. Exactly, that's all about you, Teddy. It's all about you. Let's go and come back. Save. And I guess we'll just end the day for the day. Kinda wanna actually run around the city for a bit. That's actually what I wanna do. Hmm? Yep, quit exploring. Go back to home? Yep. Okay. I'll see you later. Bye. Bye, Teddy. Welcome home. Hi. Okay guys, I'm gonna go ahead and actually wrap it up right around here. This has actually been awesome. I wanna continue playing a little bit more, but for the sake of you know, saving space on my hard drive and making sure I don't kill my hard drive. I'm gonna take a break right here, and then I'm gonna come back in a little bit. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed Persona 4 Let's Play. Uh, I'm really freaking loving this game. This game is great, and I can't wait to play more and more and more of it. I hope you're enjoying as well. My name is Samriel. Like, subscribe, and as always, have a great day. See ya.